I woke up on the bench. I woke up at, at when it's light out as well. That's a first. Let's have a look outside. It's very foggy. Well, I need water for starters. And I think I'm hearing a deer. I'm in a hunting lodge. That should be a great sign for me, but um, there's no way I'm going to kill it from here. I think, I really think I need to focus first and foremost on uh, getting, a, uh, getting a bow and arrow, because I don't think I'm going to find a rifle anytime soon. Let's take some extra charcoal. I can't navigate just yet, but I can have some extra charcoal on hand. So... What do we think? Just leave now. It's very early in the morning. What am I doing in terms of weight? An extra whetstone can't hurt. I gotta keep sharpening my uh, axe. Because otherwise that's gonna die. I'm assuming I don't run into that bear again. I'm considering trying to take that rope down. I've got uh, a full day's worth of energy, so that should last me down the bottom, at least on a descent. I'd be interested in whether or not I can climb up, but I reckon I can climb down. It would get me around that bear if it's still there. Where was it? One slight problem is I believe... That's an anchor for a rope, and I actually need to get down there, because they look the same, these rocks, unless there's a way around and to the side. I could try going this way. Nope, probably not. I think... Should have a torch ready. I can't really stay here. The temperature's low, but not that low. I'm quite warm. I'm only getting two points down. Uh, that's a risk. Is it a risk worth taking? I'm gonna take these. Old man's beard lichen. Nope. Come on. There we are. Just because I'm not harvesting enough from nature. Careful. Gently. You know what? I reckon I've made a mistake. Oh, I reckon I made a big mistake. This could be an ankle sprain I don't need. I can't get back up there. And I don't know if I can get down. I guess I'm sliding down the snow. That's my best option, is to try... ...make... Uh, descent comfortable, ideally without breaking anything. I'm down back on the road. I can't see. It's cold, and I don't precisely know where I am, but I'm fairly certain if I can find a marker, I can make my way to my house, to my uh, garage. It's a garage. I've been calling it a petrol station. Now, it is a petrol station. They do sell petrol there. Um, but... It is first and foremost a garage that I'm staying in. Just listening. I thought I heard a dog panting. I'm really wondering when I shouldn't be. Birch sapling. Oh, sh 
was it? I need maple sapling. This is birch sapling. Oh, that's not as good to me. Um, but I know that's what saplings look like. They look like small trees. Which is, in effect, what a sapling is. Okay. Ah, I'm gonna have lost that fairly shortly. So, that might not be that useful to me. What do I need birch sapling for? Oh, you know what? I'll think about it later. Aha. These... This is the cabin. I think that I first... Well, if I've explored it, I'll know. I'm gonna head inside mostly to... Uh, fix up my warmth a bit. Reclaimed wood. No, I don't think I have explored this one. Oh shit, I don't know where I am then. Let's just drink that. Work pants. That is finally a second pair of trousers I can wear. Give me a bit of extra warmth. Alright, let's do some searching. Put the torch away before I accidentally light it again. More bloody spray paint. I don't exactly know where this is. I'll eat that straight up. Breakfast, old bedroll. I'll take the pork and beans. That's that's good. That's a nice bit of calories. Free flare. And now I've now got enough sprain risk. Do you not have a sprain risk, by the way? If you're going down ledges, like if, if you just happen to be going down in that uh, on on steep surfaces. It's only when you're overburdened and have a steep surface to climb down. I haven't been there before, so that's a problem. On the other hand, I think I can vaguely tell where I am based on where this map is, so if I'm right, I just gotta head inland a bit. Oh, no, coastward. That's it, that'd be inland. It's getting nice and warm. I think this is a good day to be out and about. I'm gonna head further along the coastline once the fog clears up a bit. I know it's foggy as shit and I can't see, but apart from that, it's a good day to be out. That might actually just be a random location or center of the map. It won't actually tell me where I am relative to anything else. What I want to do, if I can, is head to some of those islands. Is that a woodpecker, by the way? That thing that sounds like a machine going off? That might be a woodpecker. I don't know if we have them where I live, so I don't know what they'd sound like. Wolf. It's alright, not bothered by the wolves. I'm worried about bears, but I'm not bothered by the wolves. I'm worried about getting lost, really. If I can find the coastline, I can find my location. Road. No, that is just in this. Yeah, I've got no idea where I am. That's in the middle of the ocean. I am not there. I may have gone quite wide. This isn't. Oh, you, now I know where I am. <laughs> Alright, I'm just nearby. Alright, let's dump off some of this. Uh, particularly, the reclaimed wood is good. And maybe we'll have a look in to crossing the lake and uh, checking out those islands if the fog clears around midday. That would be ideal.
Careful on steep sections. Last thing I'd want to do is roll my ankle at the last minute. Um, um, I'm trying to remember where this garage is. There it is. Now, there will be wolves out there, but I'm not... Like I said, I'm not too worried about them. You know what I can do? Probably come in here and break down some reclaimed wood for a while. I've got a spare whetstone, uh, so that's not going to be a problem. I'll uh, drop that here, along with some other stuff. Like, I've got some ammo I could probably put away. Am I putting ammo somewhere? Water purification tablets up there. I almost... That would have been bad if I'd forgotten that. It'll say empty. It'll say searched if I've got stuff in. So, there's water purification tablets in there. I haven't got, like, an ammo section. Alright. Drop all. I'll leave the rifle ammunition. But that'll keep all my pistol ammunition in one place. Um, um, um. I got a spare flare I can put up with the other... With the rest of my collection of spare flares. Nope. Oh. I've got... I don't know if I need that bedroll. Uh, I'm going to use that reclaimed wood. There's the whetstone. Okay, I had to, I had a whetstone on me. I probably don't need one if I haven't got my hatchet. But I'm going to drop the whetstone I just picked up. I am probably... Yeah. Let's start this fire. Tinder plug. Cardboard matches. I've got so many tinder plugs. i got plenty of books. 75%. I'm going to use wood matches. To increase that, I'm going to start the fire and I'm going to boil some water. I can never have enough water. Especially when you got a cooking pot. You can make so much. Uh, I'm going to add the reclaimed wood I picked up. I'll probably need all three of them in there. Okay, and now until melted, I'll need more time, so I'm going to grab my hatchet. I'm overweight. Now, where was I keeping spare cans of spray paint? Over here. Don't know specifically why I'm keeping them over here. I've got a very, like, ad hoc process for all this. I just sort of know what I'm doing with stuff and remember where everything is, but it's probably not ideal. I want that arrowhead in my tools drawer because I think I can make an arrow out of it. Um, I am wearing all of the clothes I have. In terms of everything else, let's just check that there by weight. Bedroll I can probably drop for now. Sewing kit. Dum da dum. I need that. I need all of that. I've probably got some food I can let go. I'm gonna pick that up. Sewing kit goes with my other spare sewing kit. Ah, my two other spare sewing kits. I have a spiral cleaning kit as well, don't I? That I can uh Drop off as well. And food. I got a lot of drinks. Let's drop that. Let's drop the tomato soup that's in good nick. The herbal teas. Uh, I'll keep the coffee on me. Some of these chips. All right, that'll do for now. Hmm. There's not really enough space here, is there? 
And I've kind of done this badly. It's just, you know, it's not well organized. I know, I'm not a very well organized person. How are we doing? 29 minutes. All right, let's break down. Hmm. How long will this take to break down? 45 minutes. Uh, I think I've got enough time. Six reclaimed wood for that. 21 minutes. It's another 40 minutes till that's boiled, so I will add another reclaimed wood, and that will just burn out, so I don't actually need to, like, worry about it. Let's put all of that. I've got... No, that's... That's the... That's not... I don't... I want that in there. Other way around. Charcoal, I've got nearly 1.2 kilograms of charcoal. I probably don't need that. Alright, here's what I'm going to do while waiting. I'm going to take these driving gloves, and I'm going to break that down. Harvest 10 minutes for cured leather. Harvest this for more cured leather, and they can repair my boots one day. I'll put the spare cured leather I have, that'll be crafting. There we are, four cured leather, I'll put all of that in here. I've got cloth I can turn into bandages, I've got crow feathers that aren't weighing anything that I don't know what to do with. Six minutes until boiled. Can I craft bandage from... Okay, I can craft bandage from cloth, obviously. Old man's beard's wound dressing. Apply to wounds to help prevent infection. Okay, that's probably worthwhile having, so I'm going to... Hold on. That is a lot of extra water. What have I got? Food, right? All right, drop two liters that I just made. No, the smaller one. Yeah. Come on. That's going out. Which is fine by me. What are my shoes doing? 98%. I'm good. 83. Alright. Um, let's check outside. Wait. I'm down to 32 kilos still. Check everything. Uh, what definitely don't I need? Alright, I'm going to... I've got lots of paper. Let's just... I've got rocks in there, fine. I can also have stacks of paper. I can put in... Um, all of this newsprint roll. Three torches isn't probably helping. Let's drink some of these uh, cans, particularly the 20% one. That's not going to be worthwhile much longer. Doesn't get me down to much. All right. Let's head outside and have a look. Not better. An hour and 30 minutes. If I do check this car, I must have done. No, I didn't. No, I did. I just didn't put the uh, windshield wipers down. No, not the windshield wipers, the uh, visors down. I really should mark these houses as I go past them. Uh, 
Don't know what I'd like to navigate. Somewhere... Somewhere out there are some islands that have houses on them, and they will have loot. And it would be nice to get them. But it doesn't look like it's, I'm going to be allowed. It was just howling. I'll wait for the barking. Then I'll light the torch. Alright, I'm going to go inside and fix my new jacket anyway. I'm actually gaining temperature out here, amazingly. You know. I just wish it were, like, I wish I had some higher visibility. Okay. Probably worthwhile just... Doing some repairing. Hour and a half. Decent wool sweater. The thermal underwear. Ragged wool socks. Decent wool socks. How would it take to uh, repair my wool socks? 55%. 75 minutes. Take 45 minutes. Sure, why not? Only takes one cloth. Eighty-five percent Good. Let's have another look outside. I don't know if I can gauge the uh, weather outside, whether it's frost, whether it's still foggy based on the light coming in the windows, but it looks brighter. Alright, I got a bit of distance. It's lifted up uh, partially. The weather's still good. I'm getting tired. But I'm... I'm at least interested. In heading out, I still can't see the islands. At least I'll see the wolves coming. There you are. No. Well, all right. The wolves like to hang around here. What if I just headed down the road a bit? Wish the snow builds went in the way. I don't know why. It, just mounds, snow mounds. I don't know what they are. They just built up, probably from the snow plows. Used to come through here and push it all aside. They create these side mounds. I assume it doesn't snow where I live very much. But, you know, if it snowed like any amount anywhere near where I'm at. Like, everything would stop. Just, like, society would be put on pause for as long as it took to melt. We, we just wouldn't know how to deal with it. Fishing locations. Hmm. I don't see any wolves. I'm gonna brave it and head directly off into the into the lake. I don't know if how, whether or not this is a really bad idea, but you see that island, I can just see if I turn my camera the right way to extend the view. That island, or one of these islands, has a house on it. See the wolf there. I'm right, getting a bit of extra vision now. Yep. Yep, we're good. Alright, thank you for clearing Den Fog. Okay. So we got these little fishing huts that I can use. I'm going to try and stay off the bluer areas. I think that's... I don't know why, but... I feel like that'd be worse to stand on, more likely to collapse. And the last thing I want to be doing is falling into the water. 
All right, so we got a burnt out village over there. I think I see some intact houses actually, but there we are. You see that house on the top there? That's where I'm headed. Now, obviously, torch ready. No doubt there are some wolves on this island. That's okay. I'm not scared of them at this point. I think I can hear them. Is that a cave? Well, there's definitely some stuff under here. I'm going to have a look. Search the backpack. Field dressing you kill volume one. I think I've already got that. And a water bottle. I'll take it. There's... That's a human skeleton. That's more of a skeleton. So probably not boding well for me. Okay, off he goes. It's a little steep to climb, but I think I might have run him off. There might be another one around here. Wolves do hunt in packs. I'm going to keep it lit for a while. I don't think they charge you. I'm fairly certain they don't charge you if you're holding a torch. They're really angry at me up here. Just keep moving away. Head towards the house. Misanthrope's Homestead. I'm going to take that firewood and pop inside. Affliction spare, sprain risk. That's alright. Just on his doormat. There we go. Wolves aren't a problem. <laughs> Yet, still frightening. Okay. I'm just going to eat these ketchup chips. So, we're not stuck here. We just... Oh, more lantern fuel. Good. I'm not, at least I'm not running short on that. Take that. I'm going to eat something. I'm, I'm definitely, like... Just weight is a problem. That's just a fact I have to deal with, but not too much a problem just yet. Food. I'm going to eat these chips. And then these sardines. Okay. More ketchup chips. They like ketchup. How? Why do they like ketchup chips so much in Canada? Is that a thing much over there? I mean, I remember Smith's did a run around here, but I was never curious enough to actually try it out. I like Heinz tomato sauce chips. Moldy rabbit. Hmm, that doesn't look healthy. 35%. Might leave it. I don't think I need that rabbit. Maybe if I'm really hungry. I don't think I've got anywhere to cook it in here anyway. Fresh rabbit cooked. That one I'm eating, and I'm eating it right now. Food. That's 100%. I don't know why the one in the oven was at 100%. I mean, it was cooked, I suppose, but it was, surely that should be rotted by now when you've got a moldy rabbit in the freezer. But, you know, never look a gift fresh cooked rabbit in the mouth. Nom. I may end up staying the night here as well. Mostly for energy reasons and, you know, I don't want to have to get away from wolves while exhausted. But, you know, that is the benefit of exploring, is that you can spend the night. You're not required to head back home. This isn't Subnautica. It. I'm just replenishing all the food I've eaten. 
So many peaches. Keep eating stuff. Sometimes it's just better not to have the weight and just have it be calories. Decent old-fashioned Parker. Compared to my Peacoat, which I just... No, I haven't actually repaired this one. Less waterproof by a long way, but it would be... Like, this is waterproof. That's outer layer, okay. This is less waterproof, but warmer. Less, what is that? Less protective. By a two points, two percent. And a little slower. Alright, I'll put it on, I'll put it underneath my pea coat Because that, uh, means that I, I, I should still be getting the, uh, the waterproofing from the pea coat and then the warmth bonus from that. And then I can just drop off the worn pea coat. That way I don't have to repair it and waste time on it. There we go. It's just a shelf. Interesting that the misanthrope doesn't have a fireplace, it seems. He's got a, like, gas stove. Which, you know, you'd think if you were a, if I were a misanthrope, I'd probably have my own fireplace. So I didn't have to rely on, you know, the, the, the gas main. New mariner peen coat. A lot of mariner pea coats. I'm leaving that behind for now. Okay. Oh, I got... I need a drink. So I've got plenty of water. I only... I'm only worried about drinking it, because, uh, taking it, because it's just weight. It's, it's very heavy. It's water. And it's not immediately useful to me, because I can make a lot of water. Like, I don't think I need to be picking up water. Since I picked up some lantern fuel. Okay. What I'm looking for is the possibility that he's hid a gun somewhere. The misanthrope would surely have a gun. Cotton plant shirt. No, terrible. Absolutely awful. Break it down for cloth. Okay. If anyone's gonna have a gun, it's someone described as a misanthrope. I'm trying to look in corners and under... Well, there's another pry bar, but Jesus, I don't need more of those. I'm going to bring it downstairs, put it on the coffee table in case I need it later. No, oh, I pressed the wrong button. I right-clicked it and it just bamped back up. I did miss that can of food. It looked like some of the other stuff there. What is that? Pinnacle peaches. What a shame. Thirty-five. I'll still be overburdened by the morning, but I got plenty of energy left to do stuff. So I'm going to have a quick, and I'm going to have a torch ready, but I'm going to have a quick uh, search around the outside just in case there's a stash somewhere. Now there's some crow circling something down there. Could be interesting. Could be nothing at all. Corpse of some description. Now what I am also going to do is grab one more old man's beard lichen. 
And with that, I can make another dressing. So I'll have two Old Man Beard's dressing. Uh, and I won't be carrying the extra lichen around. This has been a bit of a bust. There's another island. I think there also may be another... Just gonna have this ready because I still want to look around a bit. All right, we're done. You guys are annoying. Waste of a match. Could have just gone inside. All right, I'm gonna keep my hands busy for a while and uh, you know, just do some stuff. I'm gonna craft. Sprain risk is fine. Well fed is good. I'm very well fed at the moment. So, crafting. Use the remaining. Oh, I've got. S okay, well. I'll craft. I'll craft two of them for 30 minutes. Now. These are both volume one. I can leave one behind or I can burn one. I've got no way to make a fire in here, which is less than ideal. I've got 20, uh, I've got two lots of accelerant. Do I have, how much lamp fuel did I pick up by the way? I don't know. I think it'd be in, would, would it be in tools? Yeah, here it is. Uh, 0.16 liters of lamp fuel. I think. That's not what I meant to do. Actions, refuel. Yeah, I can just put it straight in there. Maybe I should make a fresh torch, but I've got three torches on me, and frankly, I don't need a... Another one. How do you repair this? Hmm. Scrap metal. Okay, um... Which one... Which book have I read most? I want to finish... I was about to finish a book. Alright. Let's research this for another hour and finish off that book. That way I've got two burnable... readables. Alright, that's increased... My fire starting ability, which is good. Which one is that? I'm actually at level 2 for fire starting, and I'm getting better at mending. Uh, okay. Alright, so it's the arrow shafts that actually require the birch sapling. I found some birch sapling, but I have no idea where it went. I can make two arrowheads. I've got one on me. Assumedly, putting these two together creates a arrow. I think I also need some... Uh, here we go, simple arrow. We'll also need some crow feathers, which I actually ha ten happen to have on me. So I could... If I had my axe or my hatchet with me, I probably could have started curing some birch saplings. Oh, I need a hunting li knife. Or a hatchet, which I do have. But I didn't have it on hand. Novice fire starting level 2. Yay. Okay. Let's do something else. Let's... Anything I could repair. 80%. 96%. I'm going to repair my... No. Oh, uh... I'm going to repair my toque. With the sewing kit. That is at 86% now. Okie dokes. I also have some firewood on me. Be better back at uh, home for that. I could leave some of these behind. This is now completed. 
neither is, oh, I've got to start reading one of these. So I'm just going to read uh, one chapter of Field Dressing Your Kill. Wow, I've still got some energy left. You can't focus on research when you're this tired. So I didn't even get through that hour. That was just a waste of time. Oh well. Not much really got done today, but I explored more of the map. I just don't know what to do and when to head back. If I find more of those bird substances, I've really got to, um, like, take a proper note of where they are. It's too bad it was so misty. Uh, just to extinguish that. Put away. Uh, I'm going to make sure I sleep for maybe 10 hours so I don't wake up in the dark again. I keep doing that. Yeah. Feels like 18 degrees Celsius. Actually, genuinely toasty. Uh, 